I am gonna strip all the paint off those wheel covers. I'm gonna use Clean Strip Stripper, which is pretty harsh stuff. So if you try this, if you use this stuff, make sure you wear protection for your hands and also work in a ventilated area. It says it works in less than 30 minutes, but I'm gonna leave it on longer than that. All right, it's about two hours later, and you can see that stripper worked. So now the fun begins. I am now putting a second coat of paint remover on all four rims or wheel covers and I'm going to let that soak in overnight so I'll be back in the morning. It's the next morning and that paint has been softened up so now it's just a matter of getting it all scraped off. This is 220 grit sandpaper and a wire brush dipped in mineral spirits. Now I'm going to clean them off with some degreasers, set them out in the sun and when they're dry we will put some paint on them. Paint's going to be Krylon Fusion All-in-One Paint and Primer. The color is Metallic Dark Metal, followed by Krylon Color Max Clear. Lighter coats are better than heavier coats, so I'm going to call that one coat on this one. Time for the second coat. If you happen to go with Krylon Fusion paint, there is a six hour window and within that six hours you can put multiple coats of paint. But if it dries for over six hours, then you have to wait 24. The two coats I put on were in the span of about 10 minutes and now I'm going to put a clear coat over the top of that. That's it for the clear coat. Now I'll let them dry overnight and we'll put them back on tomorrow. It is the next morning. Everything is dry and here's what we have. Kind of a textured look, a powdered look, which I'm okay with actually. And what I think I did to come out with this texture accidentally, I didn't wait for the paint to completely dry, which would have been six hours before I put the clear on. I put the first coat of paint, waited about 10 minutes, second coat of paint, waited about 10 minutes, first coat of clear coat, waited about 10 minutes, second coat of clear coat. And this is how it turned out. All right, I got them back on and not sure if I like it or not, might be a little bit too dark for me. I may go back with a lighter silver. If I do, that'll be easy. All the prep work's been done. It'll just be taking them off and repainting them, but I'll give that a few days before I decide. But if this is what you're looking for down below in the description, I'll put a link to the paint and the color that I use as well as the clear coat. That's it. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.